Hey guys, welcome to episode 2 of Hermitcraft Season 10. As you can tell, I'm a little sick now. I don't know who I caught it from. Grian, perhaps? Maybe he's gone. Anyway, I have been working so, so hard off camera, and I haven't been recording very much of it at all because I'm sick, and you can tell from my voice that I'm sick. However, we're going to make this short and sweet, okay? I have been working hard, and I want to show you my farmhouse. This is my farmhouse. It's based on a design by Gold Robin, except I changed some blocks and I changed the roof. I think I made the, the, the thing outside a little bit bigger, and I changed a few little design elements as well. But it's based on a design by Gold Robin, and I want to give credit where credit is due. It was a cool-looking farmhouse. I just made it look not, I won't say cooler, but more to my liking. As you can see, the inside, still pretty empty. And I'm sure you heard me say farmhouse there. And that brings me to this season's theme. I want to have peace and quiet and serenity. I want to come to my farmhouse, have some animals, have crops, and live a simple life. Last season was a very complex life, a very isolated life. I guess, <laughs> I guess I'm choosing isolation again, but I'm not. I'm not. I'm, there's people everywhere. There's people everywhere. But I want to be able to come back to my base and relax and not, and not have to think about, oh, how many maps do I have to make today? Because maps, I've had enough of maps. I also wanted to terraform around my little farmhouse there because I didn't really enjoy, you know, Minecraft's terrain isn't the greatest. You know, it always looks a little jaggedy, a little sharp. So I wanted to smooth everything out and that meant removing my temporary farm. And after hours of collecting dirt and placing dirt and digging dirt up and replacing dirt, I have uh, kind of come up with something that I kind of like. There's still things that I want to do. Like, this is really the only part that I've terraformed. I've got to terraform the entire area behind, behind me to make sure it looks good. But so far, not terrible. Terrible? Bad joke, I know. Anyway, so yeah, I have to terraform. I mean, back here, it's not too bad. Uh, I have to kind of smooth this out a little bit. Gonna get rid of all this grass and these sunflowers just so I, I know what I'm working with here. Um, down here leads to a ravine that I was using to mine a little bit. Gotta get rid of these trees. And we gotta start marking out our pastures for our animals and our crop fields. And then we're gonna have tractors and silos and outbuildings and everything you'll find on a farm. I don't know if anybody owns this little hill here. Because if nobody owns this little hill, I want it. And I'm going to terraform this one as well to kind of smooth it. Probably take a take it a couple layers down. Which, by the way, I dug off three layers, I think, from that hill and uh, and smoothed it all out. But if nobody owns this, I think this would be a perfect little hill for, I don't know, some sort of, some sort of farm-related item. By the way, if you've got any ideas on what I should include in my farm, I mean, I live on a farm. So <laughs> it's not a real farm. It's kind of a hobby farm. But I'll know what I want. To put on it for the most part but i'm open to suggestions i'd also really like to take down this hill because it's kind of i don't like the fact that it's higher than the hill my house is on and it's ugly this is what i mean minecraft's jaggedy terrain anyway this episode is going to be fantastic but first before we get to that let's announce the winner of the contest in episode one and announce the trivia uh, question for episode two let's announce the winner from episode one of the hermitcraft tcg booster box giveaway it was Alex K who correctly answered that the golden apple effect card was the first card that I made. A lot of people were confused. A lot of people said the BWO card. That was the first hermit card I made, but not the first card that I made. So congrats, Alex. Lots of you got the questions right, but of course I can only pick one winner. They have already been contacted by email. Okay, next question. Let's see, let's see. I think this one's not gonna be Hermitcraft TCG related. Let's go with what season? did I first join Hermitcraft? That's right, what season did I first join Hermitcraft? You will remember, here's a clue. I joined and then the NHO was formed. That's right, the NHO. Who knows what the NHO is? That could be another question for a future uh, trivia thing. Anyway, good luck to everybody. Once again, Canada and US residents only for this contest. I'm still working on getting some information about other countries and other things like that. So Canada, US only. And remember to email me at hermitcrafttcgcontest at Outlook com to submit your answers now back to this very very fun episode i can't wait to show you guys what i have in store for the rest of the episode i've got some really bad news in episode one doc made these comments all right right we are like there's some cooked salmon going in here and if anybody mm. needs food 
Nobody oh, wants Sam to sell. Town. Didn't you realize? Nobody oh, wants Sam to sell. Town. Didn't you realize? Nobody oh, wants Sam to sell. Town. Didn't you realize? In response to those comments, I received a not so great email. Big Salmon is not happy. Since then, there's been some correspondence, and I've been asked to do something. I, it's not something I want to do. Now I just got to get Doc over here. Just stealing my pumpkins and melons. This is not your stuff. Get your own pumpkin patch and melon patch. This is communal. Give me those melons. This, you're unbelievable. It's on. Boy. It's on. <laughs> Are we racing? Is that what's happening right <laughs> I'm now? Just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I need some silk I'm touch. Being... Where's the where's the where's the silk touch guy? Maybe he could die accidentally. Doc would be very upset if you did that. I spent two days over here with Doc. Doc would so be equally. Doc my, my is single-handedly responsible for making this wonderful community <laughs> area. I'm at your boat oh, with a, a gift. Okay, let me just see what hmm. this gift is. I want to see what it is too. Hello. Yeah, Where is he at? There he is. What's the gift? Hi, Iskal. Iskal. What's the gift? Hold on. I'm here to see the gift as well. Yeah, we came, both of us, to see the gift. What's the gift? this gift better be good. It better be good. This I horse is freaking out. Thing. <laughs> we have to traverse the lands to get here. <laughs> Come on. Oh, oh my gosh. Is <laughs> what is happening with this horse? Hello, okay, baby. My here. secret ally. Oh, hi, hi. Yes. Yes. Well, it's not uh, secret if you keep uh, telling uh, everybody. Uh, hi, it again. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness sake, can you take, can you store this horse like a normal man? Oh, he what broke the lead. On? He broke the lead. Yeah, break the lead. Store this Jeez. horse like a normal man. It's annoying. Here we go. Dig a little hole. This is not no, no, how no, you no, store no, horses. No, 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 no. Oh, get, get, okay. get, get off him. Yeah. Get off him. He left no, it don't, <laughs> no, don't come back with the horse. Come on. Karalis. That horse has problems. Iskal, do you have a spider farm or a skeleton farm? I have a skeleton farm. Did yeah. you see a, a Coralis' spider farm? No, I didn't. Look it. Come this way. Check this out. Whoa. Oh. Hello? Where'd you go? Iskal! Oh! Iskal, did I get you? Did I? <laughs> Can you hear me? I think he's disappointed in me. <laughs> uh, no. I, I tried. I tried. What's happening, I tried. I tried to get him. I put down. I went down oh. and I put down a blue wool just before he jumped down. And he did jump down, but I don't know. What happened? He's guy. You have feather falling, don't don't you? Well, you feather falling, there, right? There's one. There's one enchant that you have to have when you play these games. It's feather falling. Yeah. Did you at least fall yeah. for it? No, he, he fell for it. <laughs> no, but you went down. You went down. <laughs> yeah. You went down. I mean, does it hurt? Try it. Oh, here he comes. Hey. How did it? How did it? How did it's it do? A, well, half half a health about with feather falling. Oh man, I thought yeah, I had him. Terrible. I thought I had him. So, yeah. I, you so Iska, what, what's 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 the, worst the gift? Worst actor I've ever seen. <laughs> what, yeah, what's the, the worst gift? Actor I've ever seen. What is the, what's gift? the gift? There's no gift. We now. won't know. There's no gift now. What have I done? Why? I've, he he tried <gasps> to trick. Yeah, I did. He stole your diamonds. Oh, my diamonds. But I don't understand this. So I come over. I'm like all happy, like ooh, nice <laughs> boat. And then then here's what I here's but, what I, <laughs> what's the gift? Well, I haven't done that. There was beef beef uh, doing. No, it doesn't come with interest, Iska. No, it's not interesting. It's an Iskal man edition. This I'm is what happens there. when you're nice to me. Oh, I guess I shouldn't have tried to kill you then. All right, Corrales. This guy, can you believe? I know, <laughs> whatever. I, I mean, I, I had to try. He's. I think he won the last demise, didn't he? He did. Oh, yeah. oops, sorry. see, see? Sorry. He can still sorry, hear sorry. me. Oh, he's, he's back. Floater, like, how, how are we going to do this? What, you mean kill him? Like, I would, I would, I would get a trap set up, but I'm not sure how. Just, uh, it's yeah. Iskal, right? There's a traitor. Okay, I think I'm, I think I'm happy with this stuff.
It does sell five pufferfish. You know, there might be a trap for the skull. Pufferfish trap. Ooh, yeah. That is just a matter of luring him into a position. That's the problem, Standing, though. Talking to him. I mean, it was pretty easy to lure him into that hole. He actually jumped down, but he didn't die. Yeah, but the thing is, like, let's say we have, we trap, like, we have, like, an area underneath here with tons of pufferfish. He comes by, we just, he stands in the spots. We just kind of, like, mind in the, the, the dirt underneath him. He falls down, pufferfish gone, dead. I like it. I mean, how many pufferfish are we going to need? Well, at least eight, I guess, right? I bought three. I bought three. I don't have any enough emeralds to buy any more. But the thing is, where would we do this? I think your place would be the best place. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. You start digging a hole. Oh, my God. To fill it. You came out. That was amazing. Okay. <laughs> but, but look at this. It's just... It's, let me I know. Just, okay, let me just... Oh, my goodness. That's the Michael Jordan of horses. Okay, I'm going to start digging. How big of a hole do we need? Three by three would kind of be okay. at least like eight to nine blocks. No maybe problem. deep. Got it. I'm going to grab the puffer fish. We'll see you soon. Hi. Does this work? Obviously, obviously, obviously it could work, yeah. I have five on me at this stage. Mm -hmm. And you have five. That's going to be ten. Right? I only no, have, have three. I only right? have three. I only have three. Yeah, but that, that's, that's eight. That should do it. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm just trying to... Fill it all up here first. You could have just done an infinite water source down there. But, <laughs> I know. But, <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. You thought of that as well. I I'll thought of it afterwards. <laughs> yep. <laughs> but now I'm stuck doing this. I don't want to just pull love on the top as well. <laughs> yeah, we could do that. It goes down. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to mark it with a torch and I'll put the diamond block here. Now I'm just, now all I need is a diamond block. You know what? I, I will uh, grab the diamond. I will be hiding in your house. Okay. Because I want, I want to see this, okay, but okay, I don't okay. want to be part of this, of this, this close by. Because this is going to suspect if I'm here as well. H Hello? Oh, I'm in the backyard. I'm in the backyard. Hello, I'm, I'm, not sure. I'm in the backyard. Over here. Over here. <laughs> oh, hello there. Come. Hello there, sir. Come. Nice, yeah. nice to see you again. It's been nice a while. Nice to see you too. Yeah, absolutely. I was just going to grab some doing? honeycomb here real quick. I, I, I need a lot of. Uh, do you have honey by any chance this season? Like I have. I have actually a deal with Tango. He's going to provide me with honey. Oh, that's good. Maybe I can get in on that deal. Um, I only have this. I planted this tree and actually a beehive grew oh, out of it. So, and nice. actually, it's actually yeah. not even full. Anyways. Anyway, never mm -hmm. mind. Um, okay, so, <sighs> Iskal, I'm very, very sorry for what I did. Okay? Well, what did you do, Beef? I tried to murder you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember now. This is, this is for you. Oh, it's fine. This is for you. What? A diamond block? A diamond block. From the man who can never get diamonds? What? Is it on the... Okay, thank you, Beef. That's yours. <laughs> this is terrible, Beef. This is really bad. I'm taking the diamond block and I'm out of here. What? Thank you, Beef. <laughs> Appreciate you. Wait, I got something else for you. I got something else for you. Oh, okay. Yeah. Do you have a silk touch pick? Yes. Can you silk touch that? <laughs> sure. I was too too slow. What are you doing? No. Do you want to look inside that hole real quick? Uh. Yeah. Come on. Just look in That's it. That's a good hole. Come on. It's a nice hole. Yeah. That's lovely. <laughs> What? Is that a fishing rod? Yeah. Yep. Do you want to stand yeah. still, real quick? Okay. Okay. I missed you. <laughs> Beef, I just—I don't think this is this is not your type of game. You have other games. TCG is great. Card games. Go, go play card games. Thanks for coming, Bye, buddy. Beef. Yeah. See ya. That that didn't go well. <laughs> <laughs> that did not go well at all. And now I'm a little bit worried that I've kind of. I've kind of awoken the beast in Iskal. Beef thirst. Can I help you with something? Yes. I would like if I could maybe trade or get for free an acacia sapling. Yes, you can. And you know what you have to do for in return for that? No. Return all my diorite. What? Return all my diorite. I don't have your diorite. Well, you took it all out. 
Did I? Yeah, you're the only one that hates this the diorite as much as as anybody on the planet. This is news to me. No acacia sap for any, you. Do you have any evidence? Don't door me. <laughs> Excuse me. That was the rudest thing I've ever seen. Oh. Yeah, I have your door. So do you have an acacia sapling for me? I mean, it's not much to ask, and I'm even willing to trade you for it. Yeah, trade me my diorite back, so I'll place it no, back. No, I'll trade you something better. I'll trade you something better. I don't have your diorite, I swear. I don't. I don't. Who took it? I, I swear. I'm not joking. I don't have your diorite. Who took it? It's, it's missing. I mean, I does it look better without I, the diorite? I don't even see a difference. Where where was the diorite? It's all along the it was all along the bottom. What block is that now? What are these blocks? Are these bone blocks? These are bone blocks. Are they bone blocks? Organic and nice. Okay. I mean, it doesn't look. I I I, I don't have your diorite though. I swear. Like I, I'm not lying to you. I do not have your diorite. I'm starting to kind of like it. Maybe it, it, it's uh, Corrales. Do you have an acacia sapling, sir? I'm just here for an acacia sapling. I'll give you your door okay. back. Okay, put my door back. Thank you. Yeah, I'll put the door back. I'll trade you. Yeah, can I have that? What What do you say? You were going to finish your sentence. Yeah, I'll give you something for it, but I want it to be a surprise. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's better than a sapling. I promise you that. Uh, okay. Do you want to take Go it on. over there? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I'm good. Okay. I'm good. I've already been over there. I didn't like it over there very much. It's nice. Okay, here. Here's a bomb. Oh, See you later. You I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing here? Nothing. I was wondering what plank this was because I thought it looked so nice and I wanted to get inspired to build myself. So I broke one to look at the block. I'm sorry. I don't believe you. I I, I promise. Like, I'm, dude, I'm alive. I would have nothing to hide here. I wanted to see what block it was because I'm using shaders, as you know, I've shared them. And my Twitch chat and I thought that this looked weird. Hmm. Then why didn't you just it's check true. out the block over here? Why'd you have to go in there? This door was, I don't know, this door was open. I just tapped it in. No. I, I guess I was attracted to the sound. Wasn't open. Wasn't open. This villager was very difficult to get in here. I'm not going to touch it. Dude, I know that a man does not touch another man's village. Do you have connection issues or something? Why do you keep connecting, disconnecting, and then connecting? Because I'm working on something. Well, you can tell me we are allies. I don't know if we are, I don't know if we are anymore. I gotta be honest. Beef, you've tried to you've tried to kill me four times today. Multiple what times, yes. What can possibly go wrong? Tell me the secret. Is I, it I to can't. Do with Corrales? Uh, no. Do you remember Beef? Do you remember? Do you remember in San Francisco, 2016? Yes. You and me, couch. Yes. Yep. Do you remember how I looked into your beard, to your, the hair of your beard, and said, "Man, that's a nice beard." Yeah. Do you remember how, when you were sad in the evening, tears come out? I offered you a napkin. Do you remember I, I don't, how, I don't when remember you were hungry, <laughs> how when you were hungry in the morning? I went to the mall in a car that I didn't own in a country that I wasn't alive to drive in, but I did it and I got you a burrito. And then, I, I, do you remember beef? Shh, 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 hush, hush, okay. hush. Do you remember beef? When in season eight, we started out, you came to my house. I stood up on the no wings club thing. Uh -huh. You were confused. You were afraid. You were scared. And I sung from my heart. Take my hand. As I dragged you up the waterfall. Take my whole life to... And you emerged up to the No Wings Club, which I invited you to. But I can't help falling in love with you. Do you remember, Beef? I don't remember any of that. I got to be honest. Well, I mean, I don't blame you, your age. <laughs> Every time. Comes with the zingers and then just leaves. Drops the mic and walks away. <laughs> I am so sorry. What are you doing have, now? 
<laughs> I had a creeper explosion that then you had terraformed it and now it's just awful. <laughs> I'm trying to fix it. I was just going to get some more dirt. I'm oh, sorry, man. Uh, Every time I come over here. No, the, no. I was just running to our farms to get food. I'm out of food and I just got these carrots. Look, carrots. Mm -hmm. I did. Okay. I did. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Where are you going? I'm just going home. No, 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 no. Hold on. Why can't I see my villager? What do you mean? I can't see him. He's right there. Can you see him? I even, yes, I even kept, I even kept an eye on him so that you wouldn't freak out. He's right here. Huh. Have you logged? Have you reloaded? Yep. Is the boat empty for you? Yep. Huh. Sit in it. Still empty. Is it still empty. Yep. Can I sit in it? Oh, we can both sit in it. That's not good. I can hear him. Dude, I need this. Oh, this is not good. What's happened? Oh, don't. How am I supposed to get him back up now? I got, I got this. I got this. I got this. Don't worry, beef. Oh, my God. Don't you're worry. freaking me out, dude. This is very important that this villager stays here. Because Big Salmon is watching. It's not up yet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Beef. Unbelievable. I'm not... I'm not evil, oh. okay? I got you, friend. I got you, friend. I don't know about this. I turned off my recording voice to trick you into feeling safe because you tried to kill me four times, Beef. <laughs> now give me back my diorite. I haven't taken your diorite. That was definitely you. There's nobody else yeah. with the skeleton farm. I don't have your diorite. <sighs> I, I really don't. I'm going to kill you so hard. No, you're not. I mean, no, I'm not. We're friends. Yeah. There he goes again. Every time I log on, you're up to something and then you just leave. Did you re-log? I see did. If the villager wasn't I did. <laughs> I totally did. Do you know why I needed to trade the acacia? Why? To make another boat? Yes, to make another <laughs> boat. It's like poetic. It's, it's, it's oh poetry. my gosh. Okay. Well, I guess I deserve all this for trying to murder you a few times this morning. Yes. Yes. And uh, if it happens again, yeah. next time I won't just replace the diorite and burn it. <laughs> I would burn your entire house. <laughs> I got a question for you, actually. Yeah. Do you have salmon heads? Why do everyone want salmon heads? This is very important. Who else asked you? No one's asked me, but they placed everywhere on note blocks for the slapping sound. Yeah. <laughs> is that why you want salmon heads? Beef? That's actually not, but I'm wondering if you have any. No, I don't. All right, I don't well, kill salmon. That that's, sounds kind of crude. They're just swimming around in rivers, minding their own business. They are, they are an ancient part of this map. Little known kind fact about uh, about salmon. Oh, there he goes. He <laughs> drops a zinger and leaves. <laughs> what is this fact about salmon? Um, they actually spend most of their lives in oceans, and they only they were born in rivers, and then they returned to rivers to spawn. Mm -hmm. But most of their, <laughs> most of their lives are spent spent in oceans. Unless it's in Norway where they farm them in a in a net. Oh, so yeah, I've seen that. Sad. That's sad. Yeah. That's that's sadman. Sadman. Sad <laughs> <laughs> that's a good one. Woo! Now I get to leave. Ho! Oh! That was too late. Ah, uh, you're right. My timing's a little bit off. I'm still this, a little bit this... sick. The moment has come. It's time to get dark here. What are you wearing? What am I wearing? Oh, it's going to be very clear very soon. Come on, step right, inside my home right. here, Doc. This is my... Why did you... What? What? I was out in the swamp, man. I'm doing things. What's up? I'm busy. Step inside. <laughs> step inside. All right. All right. I have something to talk to you about. I've got okay. A, I've got a bit of bad news, Doc. What? Do you remember what you said on our first day on the server while we were caving? I don't like to do editing. Hmm, no. There was something else. Let me refresh your memory, Doc. Do you remember saying something bad about salmon? Oh, the big salmon, yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, the next day, Doc, I got an email from some important people. They were not happy and they wanted me to teach you a lesson. What? Skiz! Skiz, bring him out! Thing? Bring him out, Skiz! You got it, boss. You got it. Hey, uh, hey, ducky boy. How we doing? Listen what here. What is wrong with you two? What are you doing? You, uh, you messed with the wrong corporation. What do you say, boss? Did we do it? Do you recognize this, this little villager here, Doc? 
Mm, look at him. Look at this guy. You recognize him? Yeah, kind of. Yeah. He recognizes you. I mean, He's one of your original uh, breeding villagers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Looks like he's not going to be showing up to work tomorrow. Oh! Oh! You messed with the wrong company, ducky boy. What is wrong with you people? Listen, Doc. Murderous. Listen. What? We apologize that we had to do that, okay? But if you don't want anything worse to happen, there are some demands from Big Salmon. What? This is what you got to do. What? I don't know what the chest is. Here, here it is. I got it. Oh, wait, that's not the, yeah, this is the one. Doing? This right here. Give it to him. Give it to him, beef. Is a salmon head. Yeah. Okay. Skiz and I will be doing salmon head inspections at a random time in the near future. You, my friend, must display these proudly in your base. Make sure that where everybody can see it. That's Put right. Put where everybody can see it. We don't want to do this unpleasantness again. Ten you of hear them? It, boy? Ten salmon heads. <laughs> if you don't want it I... to get any worse, Doc, you saw what just happened to Arthur. There must be some cultural differences. I still have no clue what the salmon stuff is all about. It doesn't matter. But I, I don't care. I'll hang them up. I, You know, it's, it's ugly out there anyways. It's a swamp thing. Jesus Christ. What's just get it done and we'll be back. <laughs> I think we got him, Skiz. I think, I think, I think he gets the message. Yeah, I think he gets the point, boss. Good job, good job, boss. Good work. Uh, it hurt me doing that, but you know, it had to be done. I was <laughs> fine with it. <laughs> yeah, you were pretty fine with it. You were pretty happy to do it. Yeah, it's a good job to you. I hate to pay you another visit. I should really clean this up. It's time for another beefy tune. Today, I bring you the beefy tune from my instrument shop in season seven. Look at these beautiful guitars. I bet you didn't know, even know they were guitars, but they are. I also had drums in here at one point and a piano. Anyway, I'm gonna recommend a song today that uh, I would I would advise some some viewer discretion. Okay, now you you should take into account anytime I recommend music, I can't control the lyrics. I can control what I like, and I like this song. The lyrics has a little bit. It, it, there is a little bit of cussing in the lyrics. There's also a very graphic video that goes with it. Watch at your own discretion, but I really enjoy this type of music, especially lately. It's very kind of vintage sounding, huh? Vintage guitars, vintage beef, vintage sounding music. The song, today's beefy tune, is Your Dog by Soccer Mommy. Really love this tune. Um, it's awesome. Great band as well. Hope you enjoy it as well. But again, your discretion is advised. All right, let's finish cleaning up this evidence. I don't want to arouse any sort of suspicion from anybody. Hopefully... Nobody other than Doc gets involved in this situation. Oh boy, that was very scary. Very, very worried about what can come next if Doc does not comply. Okay, let me show you the... Ooh, my render distance has turned way down. Hold on a second. You know, I should really think about that Bobby mod. I think that Bobby mod would be a fantastic idea. Okay, so I've done some more... Ooh, this does not look like... Are Endermen allowed to uh, pick up blocks and stuff? Because I would not have done that. So somebody must have done that. I didn't. That would drive me absolute. I feel like people are doing things to my beautiful terraforming here. Look at how gorgeous it looks. It looks absolutely amazing. I cleaned this place up. I terraformed a little bit so it looks nice and smooth. Let me go over here and show you. I think it's a better angle. There we go. Nice and smooth. There are a few sections I might go over yet again to smooth it out a bit more. But for the most part, I like it. And that is going to be it for today's episode. I think today's episode is probably one of my favorites that I've made in a very, very long time. Doc just left the game. He's very scared every time I come online. He's worried. He's just worried. Anyway, yeah, one of my favorite episodes I've done in a while. And I hope to do many, many more of these this season because I'm not tied down to making maps for a year and a half. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Remember to enter the contest to win your very own Hermitcraft TCG Booster Box. And... Check out the beefy tune, but once again, viewer discretion is advised for that one. It's a little bit... Well, you'll see if you watch it. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it. See you next time when we will most likely start mapping out and probably even placing some crops down in this wonderful, wonderful area. I even have some more uh, terraforming to do up on these levels here, and I'm going to extend this entire area, or my area, way back to where XB is over there. So I'm going to have tons and tons of space 
for the massive amounts of crops and animals that I plan to nurture this season. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.